Hello everyone, it's Yvonne here from the Aussie Goddess to do your weekly reading and this is for the sign of Virgo. So Virgo, this reading will take you from the 24th to the 30th approximately, but we all know that the readings don't always come through in that time. Please remember that not all the readings will resonate with you, they are only general um, you can always check out other aspects of your natal chart or move to another reader if you're not getting the messages that you want. Um, the readings do flip-flop, criss-cross, whatever you'd like to say. So take what you need and leave the rest for another Virgo. Okay. Using the Cosmic Tarot here. And we do have the card of the Hermit coming up. So the card of the Hermit is actually your card too, Virgo. So very interesting. But this is about taking time out here. It's about taking time to go deep inside. Perhaps you're going through a time in your life where you feel that you need to sort of dig a bit deeper to see what you want here. Um, you are sort of looking at your shadow side. So you might be one of those people working on your self at the moment, very strongly trying to find your light inside. Um, you could have had an issue, problem or situation that's left you feeling out the cold. So I feel like this has led, yeah, some sort of conflict here that has led you. Wow. And the completion of a cycle. OK, could be dealing with the water sign here because that just dropped out. But some sort of situation here that's led you to go deep inside yourself to see where you want to go from here. So maybe you've had some sort of awakening here with that cycle finishing or some sort of insight into your life that you need to do things in a very different way. Um, a lot of us being faced with our shadows at the moment in order to understand how we respond and react to things, but definitely something going on here. Okay, yeah, look at this. Transformation, death card. Could be dealing with a Scorpio as well, but definitely um, going through some huge transformation at this time. Okay, Queen of Wands coming out. I like this because this says to me that you have found your own value. Maybe you've had a string of relationships or a string of situations here that have made you question who you are. And it's about you finding your own personal value here. You seeing yourself as worthy. You seeing yourself as you know, a great potential for someone, even if other people can't see it. So trying to work on what's been holding you back and how to move forward here. OK, so some sort of situation could have been a broken relationship, but definitely learning to let go of the past, learning to let things just die off here. Beautiful. And maybe you're sort of investing time and energy into yourself at the moment. You could be, you know, going into going into a work situation as well, where you're sort of understanding your value at work. Ten of Cups coming up. Very beautiful. All your ducks in a row here, Virgo. Really understanding the direction you're going in. Five of Swords. So some sort of conflict here where you've walked away from something in order to bring in resolution. I'll give it a good going over in a moment. The Empress coming out here as well. So... There could have been some sort of situation that's left you with a broken heart here. Um, I feel like for some of you this may have been quite long term too, but I think you realised that it was done a long time ago, but you kept persevering with it. And I feel quite honestly that I don't want to blame anybody in this situation, but it feels to me like you put in and invested quite a lot of yourself in this situation thinking that it was going to get better and it never has I think you thought this person was your person but now you're starting to understand that perhaps this wasn't the right way to go there appears to be some sort of rebirth here for you though so sometimes that means second chances with someone and we do have the star here so some sort of destiny no I see what's happening here nine of swords you're being pulled away from some sort of negative situation that you've been persevering with for a long while because you have someone waiting in the wings for you here so the universe is trying to help you work through all of this past stuff in order to move towards the person that is meant for you. You've hung on to some sort of situation for way too long here, Virgo, that you needed to let go of. So now you're being sort of 
encouraged by the universe to go deep inside after some sort of dark time to understand what you want here there looks like this relationship was quite quite full of conflict um and to me you're walking away from someone could be someone who is emotionally unavailable narcissistic cold um and you've realized even though you've invested a lot in this and worked really hard to bring around this relationship that it wasn't going anywhere so it's like you have understood your own value but the universe is actually here trying to move you towards this person that is the right person for you and I think you have this anxiety about leaving something behind when you have something far more beautiful coming in in the future so you've had to be go through these lessons here to understand your own value raise your own vibration in order to bring in this thing that is meant for you so you've persevered, obviously, with some sort of karmic relationship, thinking that you could come out in front. And you know what? At the end of the day, you can't keep giving to a situation that is not giving back to you. Someone beautiful is waiting. The person you're meant to be with is waiting for you in the future. But at the moment, this is about healing, bringing yourself round here with the star to the wish fulfillment. Nice reading, Virgo. Not very nice for the person or situation you were in, but... Um, definitely a promise of much better things to come here very very interesting because I've got two cards out for you again and I don't have to read that one out to you because that's the card of soulmate so you've been through some sort of lesson here to bring you around to the happy happy card so I'll read some from that you're moving towards the right person here you're moving towards the person you are meant to be with but for some unknown reason being a Virgo you've tried really hard to try and make something work so you are absolutely coming to some sort of um, situation now where you're experiencing um, what it's going to be like to be with someone who gives back, what it's going to be like to be with someone who's your equal, someone who wants the same things as you, someone on the same page as you. So you're being led towards the ultimate relationship here, some sort of soulmate long-term relationship. But in order to do that, you had to go through this to understand your own self-value and your own self-worth. Beautiful reading, Virgo. Have a great week.